Okay, so uh, on today's episode of Things That Never Happened <laughs> is a description of a uh, an altercation on the day of the Capitol Hill riots between a Secret Service agent and Donald Trump. Yeah, this happened. Sure it did. And this woman's uh, telling us how it happened, right? Let's, uh, let's listen to this woman. Related to him, we're not. You don't have the assets to do it. It's not secure. We're going back to the West Wing. The president had very strong, very angry response to that. Um, Tony described him as being irate. This, uh, this really sets the tone for the entire account. It's only a minute long, uh, the video, but... <laughs> Uh, yeah, she tells us how Tony, the uh, Secret Service guy, you know, big tough guy working for the Secret Service, he describes how the president was irate. <laughs> uh, that kind of sets the tone, right? You know, she's describing it like a like, like the guy's an abuse victim or something. It's 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 far fetched to say the least. Let's. Um... The president said something to the effect of. I'm the effing president, take me up to the Capitol now. To which Bob... <laughs> to be fair, I can, I can picture uh, Donald Trump. I'm the fucking president. <laughs> take me to the Capitol. <laughs> I can actually, that actually sounds believable. But she says words to the effect of, I'm the effing president. It's like, I'm not sure. I don't know. Does that... It, is it believable? It's definitely believable. Do I believe her? Because the rest of the story sounds a little bit like bullshit. But anyway, let's uh, let's let's carry on. President, take me up to the Capitol now. To which Bobby responded, "Sir, we have to go back to the West Wing." The president reached up towards the front of the vehicle to grab at the steering wheel. Mr. Engel grabbed his arm, said, sir, you need to take your hand off the steering wheel. Sir, <laughs> please. <laughs> the way they have to reason with him like a, like a drunk in a bar. <laughs> sir, we're going back to the West Wing. It's not safe. <laughs> Do we believe this? Take your arm off the steering wheel, sir. <laughs> I don't know if I believe this. Uh, definitely Donald Trump is somewhat narcissistic. We know that. So he might get angry when he doesn't get his way. That sounds probable. I'll kill you! I'll kill all of you! Especially those of you in the jury! <gasps> Did he attack members of the Secret Service physically? I don't know. Let's listen to that little bit again. The vehicle to grab at the steering wheel. Mr. Engel grabbed his arm said, sir, you need to take your hand off the steering wheel. We're going back to the West Wing. We're not going to the Capitol. She, uh, she says that... Uh, <laughs> he grabbed at the steering wheel. Please, sir, remove your hands from the steering wheel. <laughs> I'm the fucking president. Take me to the Capitol. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know how much of this I believe. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm really, I'm caught in two minds. Mr. Trump then used his free hand to lunge towards Bobby Angle. And Mr. when Mr. Renato had recounted this story to me, he had motioned towards his clavicles. So, uh, a member of the Secret Service told her this story, right? So, this is a good Chinese whisper at best. Elements are being exaggerated. He said words to the effect of, he lunged at a member of the Secret Service. Now... I could imagine him having a hissy fit like that and thinking he could take on a member of the Secret Service, definitely. And when he was telling me the story, he pointed to his clavicles. Uh, did he? Did he? A member of the Secret Service. Where did Orange Man touch you? Here! And here! And here! I'm skeptical. I'm skeptical at best. I don't... Mmm... I don't know, what do you think? Do you think that Donald Trump attacked, physically attacked members of the Secret Service when they told him he couldn't go to the Capitol? 
it's within the realms of possibility, isn't it? God only knows. God only knows.